dense, regular connective tissue. These slides are made for an AMI 10A lab at Mount San Antonio College. Review, we have four main tissue types in the body. We have epithelial tissue, connective tissue, muscle tissue, and nervous tissue. The entire body can be broken down into these four tissue types. Let's review connective tissue. They're characterized by scattered cells. Uh, you have proteins outside the cells in the matrix. Um, you can have matrix that are either liquid, semi-solid, or solid. And keep in mind, connective tissue is found under epithelial layers, never on the surface because then it would be epithelial tissues. This is the chart of the different types of connective tissue. Here on the first column, we have connective tissue proper. Underneath this column, we have two types, either loose or dense. We've been talking about fat and areolar, and that would be under the loose column, but now I want to move to the dense column, and the only cells, only slice um, tissue that you have to know is the regular, dense, regular connective tissue. So let's go there next. Here it is. Dense, regular, or fibrous connective tissue is the full name. And I like the name dense, regular because it's very descriptive. First of all, when you think of the word dense, dense is something that's packed, it's full of stuff, right? And that's what this picture seems like. There's just a lot of stuff here, very little white spaces, okay? Because it's just chock full of collagen fiber. Collagen fiber, remember, we saw in areolar connected tissue. And back then, it was that thicker lines running through the, uh, the slides. It was pink most of the time. Here, you see it wavy, okay? These wavy, kind of pinkish lines are collagen fibers, all stacked nicely on top of each other. And because they are stacked nicely, it's in a very organized manner. That's why it's regular. You know, when something is regular, it's organized. And so the name dense regular is this picture right here. Lots of fibers, lots of stuff, very little white spaces in between of nothing uh, and it's very organized, so it's dense regular. Where are we in the body? We're in the tendons and ligaments. Okay, Tendons and ligaments are very strong because these collagen fibers are very strong. Now the only cells that you need to know in this tissue is fibroblasts. Okay, fibroblasts. And we saw them already in areolar connected tissue. In this case, the little squish nuclei that kind of reminds you of squamous nuclei, uh, only this is not epithelial tissue, so they're not squamous cells. This is connective tissue. So these are fibroblast cells. Now these fibroblasts happen to be wedged in between different collagen fibers. So that's why it's very uh, squished, you know, definitely squeezed, if you will, because it's in between the different collagen fibers. Here's a drawing. You see clearly the waviness of the collagen fibers. And then you see in between the collagen fibers are the fibroblast nuclei. Okay. And the ground substance is, uh, is outside the cells, outside the fiber. High magnification, each of this band would be collagen fiber. Okay. And then the little dark dots, if you will, swiggles, those would be the fibroblasts caught in the middle of different collagen fibers. Here's the fibroblast squeezed in between the collagen fibers, and the collagen fibers are the wavy bands, dark, I mean, yeah, pinkish, wide band would be collagen fibers. This is magnified 400 times. And I hope you see the, the pattern of the waviness here. Um, and then, of course, the dark stuff would be evidence of fibroblasts in between the collagen fibers. Here it is on low power, okay? Even on low power, you see the, the waviness of the collagen fibers, okay? And then the fibroblast nuclei are the darker uh, squeezed in between the collagen fibers.
this slide is the same thing but turned vertical. Okay, so don't let the orientation confuse you. It's the same dense regular connective tissue here. Collagen fibers and we have fibroblasts squeezed in the middle in between the collagen fibers. Here it is again. Wavy collagen fibers with fibroblast nuclei squeezed in between. Another look, collagen fibers are the pink stuff, and these would be the fibroblast nuclei. Low power, same look, very dense, right? Very regular. Okay, so all this picture we're looking at are dense, regular connective tissue. Wavy collagen fiber, fibroblasts in between the fibers. Here's another look. Okay, so hopefully you're getting the hang of this pattern. Pretty straightforward. Here you naturally see the fibroblasts. They're all stuck in this space in between the two collagen fibers. And here it is again, stuck in the space between. So that often helps to know that this is collagen fibers with fibroblast nuclei stuck in the middle. Here it is again. Each of this is the fibroblast stuck, squeezed in between the collagen fibers. Dense, regular connective tissue. 